Tonight, Senator Cornyn spoke to our own David Lippman about what's happening in Texas now and the help that's on the way. Uh, position to uh, uh, putting as fast as we can, and I think we're, we're getting better every day. Senator John Cornyn said Monday that government and business don't usually prepare for the worst case scenario, and coronavirus was no exception. But he's pleased with the amount of medical equipment that's been rushed here. And I do think there's been now a tremendous amount of effort and cooperation, both at the government level and at the private sector to try to meet the need. When asked if Congress should have passed the stimulus bill sooner, Cornyn said the situation had to be urgent enough to convince people to act. But he thinks the tax refunds, the loans for small businesses, and unemployment supplements will come in time to help. Well, I know the governor and the state of Texas are working very hard uh, to catch up uh, to this unprecedented flood of applications for unemployment insurance. He said there could be another round of stimulus as well, but he wants to see how this one plays out before committing to supporting more. I'm sure there'll be some glitches along the way. There'll be some gaps. And uh, those are the sorts of things I'm looking at and trying to not only help navigate through this, but also to say, well, if there is a phase four, those are the sorts of things we need to focus on first. Cornyn said that once we get past this, because we will get past this, he hopes businesses and government leaders will take distant threats more seriously. I think there are gonna be a lot of lessons that we've learned from this virus, and uh, we, better, we better learn them uh, for good, uh, or else we'll find ourselves back in the same sort of situation we were here. We've got you covered, East Texas. David Lippman, CBS 19. Cornyn said President Trump is trying to reach a deal with Saudi Arabia about oil production, which could help local energy companies.